and, and here's my point. So here you have Jake Tapper, who is now basically full on, right? Like Jake Tapper, this is something like that we would do on this show with, <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, if, 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 if we had the, uh, the, the production, if we had 75 people working on this program as well. Um, and the question is, is that will Jake Tapper do this for a Paul Ryan? <laughs> who's, who's not, who's, whose insanity is not so uh, low-hanging, but is full of, you know, when you start saying high-risk pools uh, are going to cost $2.5 billion a year, uh, when in fact they're going to cost like 20 to 40 times that, and, and that's, you don't need to be, you don't need to dig very deep to find that. That's, that's also a pretty insane lie, it seems to me. But here he is, uh, Jake Tapper. Good for him. I just hope he applies this to other uh, lies that we're going to hear about policy, um, talking about fake news versus the facts. That General Flynn had lied to the country and to the Trump team, including Vice President Pence, when he claimed he never discussed Obama's sanctions on Russia with the Russian ambassador. President Trump knew this at least as early as January 26, but he did not act on this until the media revealed the truth to you, and as it turns out, to Vice President Pence, who learned about it through the media, sources said. Sorry, Mike. The president reacted to this all on Twitter today. Quote, the fake news media is going crazy with their conspiracy theories and blind hatred. MSNBC and CNN are unwatchable. Fox and Friends is great. <laughs> of course, these stories in The New York Times, The Washington Post, CNN, and elsewhere are not conspiracy theories. These are news stories sourced by government officials. Conspiracy theories are different. They're, they're false. They're crackpot. They're nonsense. How do I illustrate what a conspiracy theory is? <laughs> How about this one about Ted Cruz's father? His father was with Lee Harvey Oswald <laughs> prior to Oswald's being, uh, you know, shot. I mean, the whole thing is ridiculous. What, what, what is this right prior to his being shot? And nobody even brings it up. That's a conspiracy theory. Or how about uh, this one about President Obama? I wish he would, because... If he doesn't, it's one of the greatest scams in the history of politics and in the history period. You are not allowed to be a president if you're not born in this country. Those are conspiracy theories. How much do you think Jake Tapper enjoyed doing that? Uh, he visibly I enjoyed seen doing him it. Smile yeah. for I don't I don't even remember him smiling like, ever. That segment looks like it took like five years off his life. And I mean, it's I mean, about five to get re, added five years re to his added life. on the next time he talks to Kellyanne Conway. I mean, you, he walked off yeah. and just must have said like that was the most satisfying thing I've done probably in my entire career. Guys, let's do this again. Let's do this every Tuesday. Guys, I'm sure he's going to the producer. Can we do this every Tuesday? Can we do, can we this do this it every lot? Tuesday? Let's, the whole thing was ridiculous. Four times. 